Dr. Chen. I'm Jenny from Hong Kong Youth Space, and in the following minutes, I will quickly show you three of the e-courses Hong Kong Youth Space developed in the previous years. And the first one is about an, a language course. This is a Japanese e-course. It is an extension, uh, or an additional element for the traditional method and learning. And in this e-course, we'll focus on some special features like a flashcard and also big knowledge. Let's go into the e-course to see in the details. While my colleagues are not in the system, uh, I will talk about uh, some background about this e-course. Uh, about two years ago, a group of teachers of Japanese courses and uh, IT developers came together and think about the needs of the students. The needs of the Japanese course students are uh, based on um, uh, their physical uh, requirement of uh, having more practice and practices at home. So um, the students will uh, learn the uh, Japanese course once a week. For every week, they will have only three hours uh, content hour. And to increase the time for uh, their practice, so uh, the Japanese uh, teachers think about to have this e-course. So this is uh, the main page of the e-course. Uh, let's go into the first one, um, Hirakana. So, uh, the student can click into this page, and when uh, the student type ah. any character, they will have some e. sound here. So uh, click on the e. click on the character, and then uh, it will show student how to write the character. It can help okay. uh, about um, the student how to um, uh, reinforce their memory when they're at home. Uh, oh. During the beginning, they learn the lesson. Then we can go to the flashcard. Just like the young children, uh, the repeating and repeating showing the same characters uh, to them can help them to learn uh, the character more effectively. So uh, let's start. The student can come to this page and then uh, press uh, any, any column and then the character will show here. And after a few seconds, say if we set the speed as um, ordinary, so it will be means at three seconds. She. She. Key. Key. So when the student uh, feel and um, he's more familiarized with the words, he can uh, speed up me and press um, uh, the one with only Key. one second uh, time lag. This is me. E. This is E. E. So by repeating and repeating the practice, the student can learn e. it more effectively. Then we can go to the e. uh, chapter e. one. E. In each of the chapters, uh, we contain many different kinds of uh, course material. I will not go into detail for each of the features, but I will highlight two of them. The first one is about conversation. So um, we communicated with the publisher and uh, obtained the copyright. So we can show the video here. This is the first time the girl and the gentleman meet. So we can see that the gentleman, uh, when he introduced himself, he will uh, show his head here and want to shake hands with the girl. But you see, the lady only bow. So this is the culture of uh, uh, Japanese. Uh, just like this video can help those students to understand um, the uh, speaking, speed and tone about the Japanese. And how about the culture? So for the culture, uh, we pre prepare some big knowledge here. So we can press the button B knowledge. Our program team prepares some B knowledge to teach the student about the culture of the Japanese to increase their interest in uh, about the, about the Japanese studies. So just like uh, this video, we uh, learned um, that Japanese people will bow. So um, we will teach them how to bow here. This is a way how to bow. <laughs> this is what exactly um, the Japanese people do. It. We also have some examples that we should not do, but I will not show you here in detail because I need to go to the second e course. And this is the only e-course that um, then, uh, we use Chinese as media and is of, instru uh, of instruction because we want the student to learn the second language using the first language. Uh, because we know the student will use, uh, will use uh, the first language better to learn another language. And 